Here they are for the sixth race. This one's sponsored by Shelley and Sands. One is Arizona Jackrabbit, owned by Del Blevins. Ryan Holton drives. Back up to the two, Ellie Tinsel, owned by Paul Shoup, with Jim Pantliano. Back to the three, Intimidator 2, owned by Laurie Kreitzer, with Jimmy Wisman. Four is Falkirk, owned by the Diamond Chip Stable, with Chip Noble. Five is Mr. Sandstorm, owned by Sherry Cox, with Greg Grismore. Six, and Wishing on a Star, owned by Neil Seymour, with Joe Adamski. Seven is Terry Sam's April Pay, Bob Harper Drives. Eight is Noble Max, owned by Margaret Haller, with Kyle Lader. Nine is Dressed to Kill, owned by Kemp and Keith, Dave Hawk. And the ten is Powerhouse Sabra, owned by Runyon, Springer, and Cole. Del S. Miller is the pilot. Post time for the sixth in seven minutes. Six race field lined up and approaching the start. They're off and pacing, and Jimmy Wisman drives Intimidator 2 to the front. From alongside is Mr. Sandstorm, followed on the far outside by Noble Max. Dressed to Kill is rushing up late. Then it's Ellie Tinsel who comes away in fifth. Two in front of Arizona Jackrabbit. Fall Kirk looks to take a tuck. Then it's Powerhouse Sabra to the inside of Am Wishing on a Star, and April Pay is last. At least 15 lengths cover the field as they race to the top of the stretch for the first time. Mr. Sandstorm, Noble Max hit the quarter in a fast 27-3. Still fighting it out now as they come to the stands for the first time. And Noble Max, hard driven to clear the front, leads it by a length and a quarter from Mr. Sandstorm, who grudgingly yields in second and is now back out on the retake. Gap of two and a half. Intimidator two is third. Three more to dress to kill in fourth. Two in front of Ellie Tinsel, Arizona Jackrabbit, Fall Kirk, Powerhouse Sabra, April Pay and I'm wishing on a star. Very fast fractions in here. Mr. Sandstorm is back on top, hitting halftime 57 seconds flat. Around the turn into the back stretch. Mr. Sandstorm on top by two. Intimidator two is moving into second as Noble Max begins to retreat along the pylons in third. On the outside, moving up fourth is Dress to Kill. Then it's two lengths farther back to Ellie Tinsel, who's off the cones and rallying. A length and a half to Falkirk, followed by Arizona Jackrabbit. Up alongside is Powerhouse Sabra, followed by April Pay. And struggling at the tail end is Am Wishing on a Star. They're at the three quarters, and it's Mr. Sandstorm leading the way. Intimidator two, Dress to Kill's up on on the outside, three quarters in 127 flat. Moving around to the top of the stretch, Mr. Sandstorm is in control, leads it a length and a quarter. Intimidator two in the pocket, second, followed by Dress to Kill, who's laboring in third. Falkark on the far outside, followed by Ellie Tinsel at the rail, driving through the final eighth mile, and Grismore starts to urge on Mr. Sandstorm, but it's not enough. Intimidator two cruises to the lead. It's Intimidator two by two, fights on for second. Intimidator two, two and a half clear, tight for second, either powerhouse sober. Ali Tinsel.
Moving back into the winner's circle is Intimidator 2. Second win this season. Three-year-old Bay Golden Son of Look Sharp at a Whisper Hill by listening. Owned by trainer Laurie Kreitzer. And driven to victory by Jimmy Wisman in 157. Up an official. Three, two exacta, fifty-five dollars and sixty cents. Try three, two, ten, one thousand three, fifty-nine, sixty. Three of three in the pick three was forty-nine dollars even.